Hello Beverly Troop, welcome back. I'm the real Andy of Beverly Hills and welcome to another piece of tea of the day. And girl, it is time to come here to the beautiful city of West Hollywood and we are talking about Vanderpump Rules, okay? We have some tea, actually it's a mix, okay? Because apparently Tom Schwartz might be interested on date not other than Taylor Green from Southern Charm and they already kind of like have a connection okay we definitely need to talk about it because the season 10 of Vendor from Rules is coming and we need to start getting into all of this uh, mess okay but before we get into it do not forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell if you want to support my channel now you can do it through the thank bottom right here now let's talk about this uh, mess Hey, oh, me. No. My friend, my soulmate, my sister. I am so glad that Juan Dixon is not here right now. Can Erica, I don't have to make you look bad. You can do that on your own. <laughs> better? Is bitch better? I'm shaking. I'm physically shaking. Welcome back, everyone. And before we start, it is time to give a shout out to our partners of this video and are the beautiful people of Liquid IV. Girl, this thing is so good. Literally saved me from my hangover on Halloween, okay? It's really, really good. But this is not for the hangover. This is all about hydration. So if you are into working out, going to the gym, playing sports, whatever you're doing that you're losing, uh, sweating and losing electrolytes, this is for you. This will hydrate you twice as fast as water. It is super convenient, literally just like little packs. You take one, you put it in your bottle of water, you are ready to go. They taste amazing. They have all these amazing flowers, green apple, various size, strawberry, cherry. I mean, the list goes on and on and on, okay? So if you want to get your liquid IB, make sure to go to the link on the description of this video and do not forget to use my discount code Shademan Empire and you will get 15% off plus free shipping. So go and get your liquid IV right now. <laughs> okay, guys. So, Vanderpump Rules. A lot is happening. I think season 10 is going to be good. Okay, I think I think they're definitely putting like an extra effort into like doing it like amazing. You know, into doing it like really, really, really good. People are excited. People want to watch it. And you know, the big storyline is going to be the divorce between Katie Maloney and Tom Schwartz. It took everyone by surprise. It was very like, oh my God, what is going on? What is happening here? What do you mean? Like we knew that they, they were like an unconventional couple, but honestly, like the fact that they actually move on with the divorce was like very shocking, right? So, um, now they are starting to move on. And, you know, Tom Schwartz have this whole situation with Raquel Levi's, which everyone is kind of like not really seeing them together because Raquel is starting to act a little bit too thirsty for everyone's, you know, taste. So, yeah, I mean, people were not like really ha having it, you know, like they were not really shipping them. And now one Bravo celebrity who was very interested in to date Tom Schwartz was none other than Taylor Green. She actually went from Southern Charm, okay? She went on Watch What Happens Live and she said that she would like to get to know Tom Schwartz. And uh, they actually met each other at BravoCon. Mm -hmm. And I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened. But anyways, now, you know, they, we are shipping them together because honestly, they really, really look good. I could see them. They're both very cute. They are very kind of like introvert kind of situation. So I actually think that they will do a great couple. Um, but we don't, the thing is Tom Schwartz is probably not going to be dating her. Although we never know with these people, but okay, listen to what is going on over here. This is coming from, um, wait, from reality blurb. Oh, shoot. Okay. All right. 
So Tom Schwartz may not be ready for a new relationship after his March split from his ex-wife Katie Maloney, but that's not stopping the Vanderpump Rules cast member from dipping his toes in the dating pool. And in addition to his flirtations with co-star Raquel Levi's, Tom has been linked to a possible romance with Southern Charm star Taylor Ann Green. Last month at BravoCon, amid a special taping of What You Happens Live, Andy Cohen, who had chatted with Taylor about her attraction to Schwartz on a previous episode of his late night talk show, attempt to set the reality stars up. I knew who she was. I think I was just feeling a little bashful, Tom Short admitted to uh, showbiz shit shit in October. Honestly, I was put on the spot on a stage in the bright lights. Although Tom Sandoval pointed out that Schwartz and Taylor will be cute together, Schwartz, after admitting the Southern Charm cast member is gorgeous, signaled to his close relationship with her former boy boyfriend, Shep Rose, and suggests Taylor had been friend zoned. Listen, she's gorgeous. We actually have like a, a rapport going. We are friends now. I am also very close to Shep. I don't know if you know this or if the public knows this. I have a really incredible close relationship with all of the guys from Southern Charm and Summer House. So yeah, I felt a little awkward. According to Schwartz, he felt awkward when Andy was attempting to establish a love connection between him and Taylor because her breakup with Shep, with Shep was still fresh. You understand my predicament, so that's why it was awkward for me. I'm usually pretty good at being diplomatic, but I kind of just shut down, blush, and put my head down like a schoolboy. While Taylor and Shep only split months ago, Shep recently gave Schwartz his blessing in terms of a romance with her. I love Thomas Schwartz. That will make me happy if she ended up with Thomas Schwartz, Shep told E! News while attending BravoCon. I am not a jealous man. We had a great, great time. If she end up with a very good guy that makes her happy, that will make me happy. But after seeing Shep approval, Schwartz, whose ex Katie has moved on from their marriage uh, with 25-year-old actor Sacha Clendenin, had now no comments. She's gorgeous, but I just feel like that's not a good idea. She's incredibly beautiful, charming, and intelligent, but yeah, we are just friends for now. Girl, sure. I mean, look, I feel that because Schwartz just got out of a 12-year relationship, she should not be dating absolutely anyone, okay? Have fun, go, you know, be with whoever you want to be, do whatever you want to do, but like, you know, just like heal completely before jumping into another relationship, you know, like kiss everyone, sleep with everyone, do whatever you want, but you like being in another relationship so fast, I don't know. However, I do feel that those two will look really, really good. And I think their personalities kind of like match. I ship them together way more than Raquel. So anyways, that's it. Let me know what you guys think on the comments below. And like always, don't forget to like this video, share this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel, guys. And I'll see you around. See ya. Bye.